that is the verdict of Premier League pundit and former manager Graham Souness. Starsport understands United's no. One candidate to take over on a permanent basis in the summer is the Argentinian. United are ready to break the bank to land Pochettino and pay more than any club has forked out for a manager in history. It would cost the Red Devils £36 million to buy him out of his Tottenham contract, while a compensation fee would have to be agreed to. Spurs are determined to fend off United's interest, however, Sunis suggests Pochettino could be tempted by the role at the Bernabeu. Real are still looking for a solution in the dugout, having struggled badly since Zinedine Zidane's surprise resignation. Santiago Solari, who replaced Julian Lopetegui, is already under serious pressure, and SAC United boss Jose Mourinho has even been linked with a return to Real. Soonest discussed Pochettino's future ahead of Tottenham's Premier League clash with Ole Gunnar Solskjaer's United at Wembley. And he said on Sky Sports, we're focusing on him possibly going to Manchester United, but there's another very big job coming up in the summer, maybe before that, in Real Madrid. Now I know that any Latin player would rather go to Real Madrid than go to Man United. Maybe a manager is the same, Latins generally gravitate to Barcelona or Real Madrid. Pochettino has recently insisted Spurs will have to change their transfer policy and spend big if they want to win major honours. Ex-Liverpool, Blackburn, and Newcastle manager Sunis agrees it is too unrealistic to rely on younger players. I read a couple of weeks ago, and he's repeated it, we have to work in a different way, Sunis continued. There's only two ways you can operate. You go out and have a splurge, spend lots of money, and you buy players and hopefully you get five out of six right. Or you wait for youth. There's only, and you think of Man United and the class of 92, that's the only team that's managed to get a group of young players who came through the system and be not just players in the team, major players in the team. If there was a magical way of working and creating that time and time again, Man United would have found that. That was a bit of stardust they got at a particular time. And if they're going to just rely on youth players breaking through and being main men like Harry Kane is, forget it they won't be challenging the big guys.